Hey guys, this is Sunsfan, and we have a very unexpected preview for you. With help from Cyborg Matt, we've stumbled across some files in the test client that show a brand new hero in development that isn't even from the original Dota. We found a screenshot of him, as well as the tooltips for all his skills. As you can see from the screenshot, his ability icons are unfinished, albeit hilarious. Unfortunately, when we tried to play the hero, his model and spell animations were completely missing. So we'll have to make do with what we have. And just to clarify, we weren't sure at first if this was real or not, but according to Cyborg Matt, the ability string tables can be found in the code, meaning this is 100% legit. So without further ado, my name is Sunsfan, and this is an introduction to Sobek the Black Cayman. Sobek seems to be a strength support slash tank hero who's hard to ignore considering he indirectly forces you to attack him. Voracious Appetite is a single target ability that will work on both creeps and heroes, but they apparently have different effects. If you use it on a creep, you will instantly consume it and gain a permanent force strength. This strength will be lost upon death, but you can stack it up to four times, therefore giving you 16 extra strength. If you use it on a hero, you'll slow them by 25% for 3 seconds and temporarily steal 16 strength from them for 20 seconds. So in total, you're able to rack up 32 strength, which translates to an insane 608 health. Link of Fortitude is Sobek's second ability and is single target as well. This one's meant for your allies, though. When used on an ally, it will create a link between them and Sobek. At level 4, the ally will take only 45% of incoming damage during the duration, while Sobek himself will take the remaining 55%. This has a breaking point of 1200 units, and a duration of 20 seconds. So with a cooldown of 10 seconds, you could theoretically use this on two teammates simultaneously. The important thing to note here is that the damage that's dealt to Sobek will be converted to magical damage. The reason this is crucial is because of his next ability. Protective Hide is a passive ability that will essentially allow Sobek to take more damage the lower his life is. For every 10% of HP he's missing, he'll gain 5% magic resistance. So to give you an idea on how this works, if Sobek has less than 10% health, he will not only have the 25% magic resistance that all heroes start with, but will add on an additional 45 to give him a grand total of 70% magic resistance. And finally we come to Sobek's ultimate, which is named Absorption. When cast, any unit within a 700 AoE will have their life leeched for 5 seconds. This apparently is not a channeling ability. The really unique mechanic with this skill is that the damage is based on how much HP Sobek is missing overall. At its highest level, it will deal 100% of the health he's missing. We assume the damage dealt will be evenly distributed based on how many units are around. So as far as gameplay is concerned, it plays much like a Juggernaut or Luna ultimate, in that it will be less effective when there are multiple units caught in the AoE. In closing, Sobek seems to be a really unique hero who fills multiple roles. At first glance, he comes off as extremely strong and could probably use some number tweaks, but we're nonetheless excited to see him in action someday. Be sure to visit Cyborg Matt's blog at cyborgmatt.com in order to read more about this yet-to-be-released hero. If you're too lazy to do that, then the link is also available in the description to the video. Thanks for watching, guys, and please remember to subscribe to our YouTube in order to keep up with our latest videos. Also, be sure to check out our website at dotacinema.com. My name is Sunsfan, and I still love you.